Fourth down. Alabama will punt. Deep man for Georgia is Fred Lane. He's a junior. He's a speedster. He's a wide receiver. Georgia's in return posture. They don't show they're going. They're going after him, but not with oh, it. It is blocked. It is blocked. And into the end zone. And it is touchdown, Georgia. I don't believe it. Kelvin Ruff covers it. And I believe it was Terry Webster who blocked it. How many times have we seen Georgia? The flag called the team running out on the That's field. Yeah, because of the celebration. 15-yard penalty on the kickoff. Listen to the crowd. 50 seconds to play. The Bulldogs block a punt and get a touchdown. This is the game of all games. Who would be the wall committee today? He has to be it. Rula back, gets some pressure, steps away from it, throws the ball to the sidelines to Richardson, steps out of bounds, up at 45 for a first down, and you've got 36 seconds to play in the game. Alabama must keep in mind a tie, or obviously it's better than a defeat, as Richardson pushes deep. Remember, the situation is such as Georgia is playing everything deep, forcing people, to, forcing the receivers up in front of them, Gives Richardson a chance to catch it and step out of bounds. And they can tie it with a field goal. That's what I was Well, they'd take say. a tie right now. I'm yes, sure. they would take a tie. First down, all just short of the 45 of Alabama. Jelks, another speedster in there. Shula getting good protection, gets it away. Bell's in the middle, and he's down at the 30. And now they're within Van Pippen's range. And the clock stops for the first down. Alabama has a chance to get up on the ball, Keith, get their play call. Shula is giving them the play. Hurry up offense, telling everybody where to go. The clock will start as soon as the chains are set. Shula to nine seconds. With no timeout, Keith. Here's the blitz. Richardson breaks to the sidelines, has the ball, steps quickly out, inside the 20, out of bounds at the 17, first down Alabama. 20 yep. seconds. What poise Eula is showing. I think Georgia is giving a little bit too much cushion. They're giving the receiver 8 and 10 yards, and the situation is such they ought to be playing, I think, like they did early in the ball game, right up on top of them. Now, if, if Eula should get sacked, Somehow, they're going to have to line up quickly and throw the ball out of bounds to stop the clock. They won't have time to get the field goal kicker in the ball game. They've got to be real careful here. I'd throw it in the end zone from here, wouldn't you? Yes, sir. He's open. Bell, and it's touchdown, Alabama. What a great performance by Shula. It was a pick play. I'm not sure it was an illegal pick play. But the man covering Bell was blocked off by an Alabama player or one of his teammates. And he came perfectly clean, wide open down the middle. Georgia being in a blitz, man-for-man -man coverage. Shula showed the call. Incredible drive by the Alabama Crimson Tide. And Mike Shula with no timeout. And the people who made the big catches for them were Greg Richardson, and Albert Bell, and Bell gets his second touchdown of the night. He caught four passes for 78 yards and two TDs, and Van Pippen nails the extra point. And with 15 seconds to play in the ball game, it goes back the other way, 20 to 16. So what had been, at times, an almost boring college football game and its conservatism and its mistakes in the early season suddenly explodes here in the waning moments and the teams come up with remarkable efforts. Keith, let's watch Bell number one. It seemed to me that he, this man got screened off. Well, I couldn't see right there. The linebacker was covering him, and that is a mismatch. I'm not sure who that was covering him. It looked like it was a linebacker, 86. See who's covering Bell. Bell is lined up in left, goes in motion, and Georgia has to adjust their defense. Right there, number 16, Willis tried to collision him and Bell escaped it had the ability to escape 
Junior College right out of Kansas. Never played a varsity game. Had the credentials to be the outstanding receiver or player in junior college last year. Came to Alabama and is a hero in the first college game.